Well, you know, I wouldn't, you use the word disappointment, I don't use the word disappointment. I have expectations of our team and I, I know how I want them to play and, and they have expectations for themselves. We weren't at our best and we weren't where we need to be and we've talked about that in our locker room. The big thing for us is we knew there'll be ups and downs with a short roster and a younger team. Right now I think we're probably the third youngest team in this league right now so there's going to be some growing pains. Um, you know, the big thing for me is getting the message back in, get back to our identity, be hard to play against, uh, work with the level of expectation that we have for ourselves and making sure that we go out there every day and every shift and putting our best foot forward. Listen, when we win, we win as a team. When we lose, we lose as a team. I know that a lot of Knights fans want to anoint certain players, you know, when Michael McNiven's in and we win because of him and that we win together. We win because we're a team. And that's the bottom line. And when we don't have a player or a line or a group maybe going as hard as they can, that hurts our hockey club. And, and uh, you know, right now up front, we've been playing, you know, one less forward. And, and, and uh, you know, for us right now, it's a matter of, you know, making sure if you're getting minutes, you're, you're earning them. That's the, that's the major message to everybody. If you're getting something, make sure you earn it. Make sure you come in here and, you know, whether it be power play, penalty kill, extended minutes, uh, you know, being in the lineup, it's on an ad earned basis. Well, I, like, if anyone's watched our division here the last X amount of years, there's no easy nights. And, and, and I don't, I don't uh, you know, whether it be Erie, Guelph, Kitchener, I don't think you can take a night off. The challenge is, is being playing your game, is coming in and worrying about yourself, executing, being disciplined, uh, being ready to compete in battle. Those are the things that we have to bring. We had a, we had a very good record against Erie last year and played them very well. We had a winning or a 500 record against Guelph because we showed up, we played. And, uh, and that's the message for our group right now. Don't, don't, don't sit across the, the ice and be in awe. Come in here and demand more of yourself and expect to win. Well, I, I, I don't really in public get into the intricacies of what other teams do. The big thing for us is to come in and match the, the level of work. When you have that, then you have, then we worry about our system, um, you know, and generating opportunities, shutting down opportunities. One thing you can say, that's why I'm not disappointed last weekend, we haven't given up a lot of scoring chances in a while. Well, defensively, we've been pretty good. We keep a lot of the shots to the outside, there's not a ton of scoring chances each period. You know, for us, it's about getting, getting our feet moving, establishing a work ethic, playing our game. This is my home. Been there about 12 years. This is the tree that once shaded my backyard. And here's what happened when a storm blew through our neighborhood. Oh man, what a disaster. Fortunately, my wife knew just who to call. The experts at Balfour. So to recap, my home before the storm, my home after the storm. Or the way I see it, my home before Balfour, my home after Balfour. Balfour. Your home, your life, our promise.